you'll never be a real hunter. And if you can't learn to be a real hunter, you'll never be a real wolf. Mowgli. Mother. What are you doing here? You promised to meet Bagheera. Oh, yeah, that's right. I forgot. As usual. <laughs> <laughs> so tell me, is Mowgli running any faster than before? Mm, he's not as fast as we are. He needs a little more practice, but he's going to be a good wolf. Right. All he needs is work. Come on! Hmm. He was such a tiny man, girl. Why, that's a man cub. What's it doing here? Poor thing. He must have lost his way. Oh. <laughs> Look, he's feeding just like our own cubs are. He's a hungry little fellow. Isn't he? Uh-oh, that sounds like Shere Khan. Get the cubs inside the lair, Lurie. Yes, dear. Come on. Here you go. I smell a man cub. I've come to claim my prize. This is not your hunting ground, Shere Khan. Get away! I tracked him here. I want him. You're not getting him. How dare you disobey? How dare you? Give me that man cub now. Give him to me. No, he's a part of my family. Your family? Ha! Huh. You'll pay for this, Alexander. I've told you before, you must hang on tight when you're up in a tree. But, Bagheera, it's not that easy. I don't have strong claws like you do. That's enough. My time is precious, and I'm not going to waste it listening to your complaints. All right, then forget it. I'll go practice on my own. Hey, Mowgli. Hey, wait. <laughs> Baloo. Looks like you're having a tough time trying to train him. Tough isn't the word for it. If you only knew. Why are you doing it? Because Mowgli insists on learning to hunt like us. Huh? Oh. Hmm. 
Oh. Look out! You're going to fall! <laughs> Whoa. Oh, Whoa. that's very good. <laughs> oh, come! I know you're anxious to learn, but don't you think you're overdoing it? <laughs> I'm sure glad you were there, Ka. Next time you're going to get hurt. Mowgli, why do you keep trying so hard? Because I've made a promise to my father. Do you mean Alexander? Yes, that I'd become a worthy wolf. That's fine. But you have to learn to listen. I'm sorry. Bagheera, there's no point in shouting. You must understand, Mowgli. Bagheera only shouts because he's worried about you. Worried? Me? Why should I worry? <laughs> I know. I won't do it again. Bye. Hey, Mowgli, where are you going? To keep my promise to father! Mowgli made a promise to Alexander. <laughs> Mowgli, promise me you'll become a brave and worthy wolf and always take care of your mother. <laughs> oh. Oh, father! <laughs> Mother, I can't find him anywhere. No, not again. I told him at least three or four times that there was a meeting of the pack tonight. He's just going to get into more trouble. Shall I go looking for him again, Mother? Yes, if you can find him before Akela starts talking. Listen, everyone. It's too late now. I've called you all here because Shere Khan, who has been peaceful until now, has begun to cause trouble with a band of wild monkeys he's gathered round him. I'm warning every member of the pack of the danger on the other side of the Kohinoor River in Shere Khan's territory. Oh, Mowgli, you again. Mowgli, I've looked all over for you. I'm sorry. Late again? How many times have I told you not to be late for meetings of the pack? You see, Akela, the moon was so beautiful tonight that I thought I'd go down to the lake and... Of course, you always have to be different, don't you? Hmm? And coming late to meetings is more proof that he doesn't know what it means to be a wolf. I think we've all heard enough from you, Lala. Stop it, Aku. I'm only telling the truth. How can anyone call him a wolf when he can't even hunt? I'm against the wolf pack taking in a human. I've heard enough, Lala. We must never forget the promise made to Alexander. Hmm. Alexander might have been a hero, but the wolf pack mustn't live in the past. What? what? Stop it. Sora, Akru, Lala's right. Mowgli did come late to the meeting. Mowgli, you must apologize to everyone. I apologize. Do you accept his apology? No, Grandfather, never! And I'll never accept you as a member of this wolf pack. <sighs> It's right there. Now go! <laughs> he approached the right way from downwind. Yes, but he still has a lot to learn. Stop! Wait, Heat! Come back here! I was right beside you, but of course you never noticed. What's going on, Mowgli? To think that this is the son of our hero, Alexander. <laughs> what a laugh. Take that back. Leave her alone, <laughs> Mowgli. Akira will be very angry with you. Stop it, you two. Now you've done it. Grandfather. Bagheera. You know that it's against the rules of the pack to fight among yourselves. Lala started it. She grabbed our rabbit. What do you mean, your rabbit? Since when does game belong to someone before they catch it? Yeah, it was ours. Enough! If you don't stop, I'm going to lose my patience. Akila, I'm sorry to interfere, but I think this would be a good time to put Mowgli to the test to see if he's worthy of becoming a member of the pack. Hmm, a test of endurance. Huh? 
What's a test of endurance? No, Mowgli's not ready for that yet. Bagheera? Be brave and stop that whimpering. But, well, will I be the only one? Of course not. It'll be a contest between you and that little Miss Know-It-All over there. Uh, me and him? Yes, it'll be a contest between you and Mowgli, Lala. You have nothing to fear if you are as good as you say you are. Oh, uh, Grandfather! Are you saying you're afraid, Lala? So what do you say? Hmm. All right, I'll do it! Mowgli? <laughs> Wait! I'll compete against Lala instead of Mowgli. Mowgli, it's time to stand up for yourself. You can't hide behind your brothers forever. But... but I'm... <laughs> Mowgli? <laughs> what happened to that promise you made to Alexander? <gasps> Mowgli! Yes, I will. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes, I will. You missed again. Are you sure you're going to be ready? The contest is tomorrow. Hope so. I shouldn't have interfered. You're not ready yet. Mm -mm. Don't worry, Bagheera. I'll be ready in time for the contest tomorrow. Remember, you'll have to catch two rabbits and three birds. All by yourself. It's not going to be easy, you know. I'll be ready. Are you sure, Mowgli? It's not an easy contest, and there's still time for one of us to replace you? It will be hard, but if he does make it, he won't have to take any more teasing from Lala. That's right, and I won't let her call me a man-cub anymore. That's the spirit, Mowgli. That's the stuff Alexander's son is made of. I'll prove I'm Alexander's son. I still wish that there were some way we could help you. It wouldn't be fair. After all, the whole point is to prove that you can do it by yourself. I know that, Sura. Uh, if only there were some way I could lend you my speed and my strength, then you'd win for sure. Just you saying it gives me strength. Thank you, Akru. Sura. Mowgli. Mother! You need to rest for tomorrow. Mother, why am I so different from Sura and Akru? Why don't I have fangs and claws like them? <laughs> Tell me, do rabbits have fangs? Hmm? Everyone knows rabbits don't have fangs. And antelope? <clears throat> no, they don't. Now, would you say that these animals are easier to catch because they don't have any fangs? Mm -mm -mm. No, the antelope are hard to catch because they run fast. The rabbits have such good ears that they can hear you coming from far off. Birds have wings so they can fly and skunks smell really bad. So you see, not all animals need claws or fangs. They all have something useful. Now, Mowgli, don't you think you have something useful too? Something that can help you besides claws and fangs? Besides claws and fangs? Mm. <laughs> don't worry, son. You don't have to find it by tomorrow. Because even if you lose to Lala Mowgli, nothing terrible will happen. And don't forget, even if you are a man cub, you are still Alexander's son and you will never have to prove yourself to me. Oh, mother. <laughs> <laughs> Mowgli, Lala, you both understand the rules of this contest. Before sunset and without anyone's help, you each must bring back two rabbits and three birds. If Mowgli succeeds, he will truly become one of us. Huh? You ready? Go! Good luck, son. You can do it, Mowgli! Mowgli, you have something useful too. Something that can help you besides claws and fangs. Oh no! I really am hopeless.
hopeless, I guess. One more rabbit to go to win this contest, then I'll prove to everyone that I am the best. Hmm? Look, a rare black rabbit on the other side of the river. My territory? Yes, she was seen by a scout crossing the river just a few moments ago. How dare she? Tell me, was she alone or was the man cub with her? The man cub? Uh, the scout didn't mention a man cub. Never mind. We can use that young wolf to attract the rest of the pack. I'm sure that man cub is bound to be among them. What's the matter, Shere Khan? It's my old battle wound. It keeps bothering me. An old wound? Oh. Alexander did it. Shere Khan. Alexander, give me the man cub now. Never. I told you once before, I will never give him up. Mowgli's my son. I warn you, if you don't give him up peacefully, you will have to fight for him. <laughs> No! I must fight him alone. Over here! by the inventiveness of the human mind. Very clever. Bagheera, how long have you been here? From the beginning. Huh? Mm-hmm. I was worried about you. Oh, Bagheera. A little worried. Since you didn't notice me, means you've got a long way to go. <laughs> What's that? The birds are warning of Shere Khan. Shere Khan's near? Can't escape me. The sun is setting. Oh. Akela! Akela! What is it? Has something happened? Lala has crossed into Shere Khan's territory. What? How could she? You had a great idea, but it's too bad you couldn't make it back in time. Yes, but as Mother said, it's more important that I found something only I can do. So I'm happy. You know, if you're ever asked to leave the pack, you're always welcome to come stay with me. Huh? 
Oh, well, yes. <clears throat> it's only if you are ever asked to leave. <laughs> Kira. <gasps> Lala! Shere Khan and Lala! Aha! <laughs> you can't get away from me now. Oh, no! It's too late! There's one last chance. Then aim carefully. I think she must be stunned. She'll drown if I don't save her. I've got you. Hang on. Mowgli! They haven't heard the end of me yet. I'm sorry, Akela. I didn't pass the test. It's not the contest that's important, but the fact that you risked your own life to save someone else. That makes you worthy of becoming a member of this pack. Thank you. Thank you, Akela. Mowgli! That tickle, I'm stop so it! Glad. Cut it out! Come on! <laughs> Please stop that! <laughs> Cut it out! Do you have any objections, Lala? <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs>